right, so we just did our very first game, ended up getting our vehicle. Um, another thing that's kind of nice is it unlocked air realistic battles, so when we're ready for that, I'm going to go ahead and go into a ground battle. It's going to be arcade, but just to open up RB. Um, let's see, let's do a preset. Let's rename it. Ground AB. Eh, we'll say RB. We're never really going to pay arcade for uh, ground. Not my thing. All right, so let's see what we got available here. Just these two. Uh, definitely prefer the M2A4 over the LVT. LVT is good for shooting, but you can basically 50 cal it or probably 7 mil pen it. So let's see these. So notice the M22 is 4,000. I'm going to research that just in case it unlocks in the next game or two. Um, that way we're going to get that for free and only have to research something that's 2900 even though it's a higher br so as usual i'm going to go through expert our cruise and double check what we're researching here so this is another one at some point it's going to give you a mod for free so best thing to do is this one's 720 one of the most expensive and artillery is great to have so we're going to research that in case it gives it to us all right that's about it one type of shell on each that's fine all right let's get in there um just because I hovered over it. So assault, you can do, um, you get a reward once per day, once for air and once for ground. Um, worth it if you want the boosters, I guess. You get some pretty good stuff, like 300% booster for a game, but it takes probably like 20 minutes to a half hour to do each. So if you have all the time in the world, easy way to get boosters for free. If you don't, then don't bother. No, how it works, thank you. Oh good, at least I like the map. Probably going to be playing against bots again. It's just fine. It's just a little too easy. Uh, definitely don't need that much ammo. We'll take 40 max. We're going to spawn over here. Normally I'd go sit behind this rock, but these guys are pretty easy. Just go right to A. Patter, let's get at her. Hopefully, we can get a few kills and get ourselves into a plane. We'll bomb the shit out of them. I'm gonna try not to capture A right away, even though I'm sure somebody will. Because basically they don't recap it, so the game ends faster. I'd rather sit out here and shoot a few of them. So we'll just cruise past, keeping an eye out. Probably as far as we should go. One to my left. Multiple left. <laughs> Saved your life, bro. Alright, let's park somewhere relatively safe. And go hop in a boat. So the bombs on these tend to have a long fuse, like, I want to say 10 seconds-ish. Um, so you're going to want to drop where they're going to be rather than where they are, typically. I don't need that PT-5 killing me. Nice. I need him capping. One bomb out. 
this is nice when they go in a good little line like this. I'm not sure what's going on there. I don't know why the controls seem to lock up sometimes. Oh, well. Camper, I like it. Boy, these shells fly all over the place without group points. Can go a little bit more. Still, Tetrarch. I should say. Don't like showing on my side, but that's all we got. Throw the weapon on. Essentially, we're just going to bomb their spawn. Which could turn out nice if done correctly. Since they're all lined up. are up. Six targets. Very nice. Alright, that takes care of that. So 18 ground targets, obviously all AI, easy as peasy. Mission maker, survivor, heavy metal, new profile icon. Alright. Oh, another guy did well too. Nice. Alright, so this is why we picked artillery support that was more expensive, because it gave it to us. So nice. Perfect. Thanks for the tutorial. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get the better rounds next. And I'm going to go to this guy and stop. Whoops. Stop researching artillery support. We're going to go for the better rounds here as well. And that wraps up game two. See you guys. America! Fuck yeah! To save this fucking day, yeah! Beautiful.